We are an hour by train from London. It's nothing, it's absolutely nothing really. Faversham is a natural commuter town. But it's just far enough to be in a completely different world. I love it. I love it. Oh well, Faversham's, yeah, Faversham's good. Faversham's very special. Because it somehow attracts very, very creative people. It's not just about the colours, it's, it's about the, the overall feeling and the popping of the frogs as they will jump back into the water. It's, it's just fabulous. The Faversham itself is glorious. Two indoor swimming pools, you have an outdoor Lido, marvellous. And always something on. Um, just straight. Have you been before? I'm in East Street right now because there's only one of me in the square. If you look up Faversham, there is always, every day, more than enough to do. St Jude, the patron saint of lost causes. A little shrine here in Faversham where people could come to ask for help. It's a very popular, what do you call an old-fashioned cinema. It's the largest screen in Kent. And it's great because it's local. Yeah, we like it. It's a fascinating, eclectic mix of people and of shops. And now it's so glamorous and beautiful. It's totally transformed. Oh, right. Look how special for the hat. Big turquoise hat like that. Oh. oh, it was that sort of colour. It was lovely. Try that. People who look for antiques hunt. But Faversham was great. It's not about things, it's about people. Beautiful, very lovely. Very relaxing. No cars in the centre. Put yourself uh, right in the heart of a 16th century market town. I think what's so special about Faversham is the architecture. It's absolutely wonderful, the buildings. The, the buildings haven't really changed a great deal. It's full of history. It's great history town. And it's very likely that Shakespeare put plays on in the courtyard of this inn. Lovely museum. Step back in time. I think Fabersham is becoming a foodie haven. Do you have a preference as to which one you would like, my darling? These are plain. They're jalapeno or I've got chocolate. The little sea bring with things France. You're not a cheese lover? It just gets the taste bugs going. Absolutely beautiful. Which is nice. 
that is my favourite anyway. You've got restaurants and gastro pubs, other little producers, other shops coming through. I mean, Faversham is a lovely place. Oh, it's lovely. You're five minutes in the country, nice people. It's just unique. It really is a hidden gem. Faversham in a nutshell. It's just a happy place to be. The whole place has got a good vibe. Yeah, it's been very laid back. Thank you. Thanks ever so much. Have a lovely weekend.